Hi everybody, it's Aquiline Spiritual, another reading. Sorry. <laughs> um, this is gonna be for all Leos for February 2024. So um I feel like someone's gonna be apologizing to you. They're gonna wanna say sorry to you. For some reason, your cup is like very, very messy. Very messy. So let's get into this. So I'm seeing letter J here right away. So you could have a J in your name. So I'm hearing something is changing for you. Wow. Hello? Hello? Like the audio just changed. Like, like my ear just like popped or like became clear. <laughs> wow. Okay. <laughs> That's interesting. So something you're going to hear clearer. Wow. Okay. Something about a home family. Your home life is changing here. Yeah, I'm hearing it's blowing in the wind. Last night, my buddy lost his whole family. It's going to take the man in me to conquer this insanity from Tupac. So maybe you're losing someone in your family. Yeah, and I'm hearing, pardon, let me upgrade you. You know? Somebody wants to upgrade you. They want to up upgrade where you live. They want you to live with them. Maybe this is you moving in with somebody. You know, you're the horse, you're the dragon, and letter Y is here. You're the dog is here as well. I feel like your money is all over the place. You're going to be making money from like different um, avenues of income here. This is not just like one thing you're making money on. You're making money on like one, two, three, four, five different things here. Five different um, projects you're making money on. And I'm seeing number eight is here as well, which is year of the goat. And that's you, Leo. Leo energy here. Your, your, your birthday could be significant this um, year where you're going to be earning a lot of money through different projects in your life. But okay, so we're talking about February, right? <laughs> Yeah, number seven is coming up a lot, Year of the Horse. I'm also seeing um, Sagittarius here. Aries, so like some kind of fire sign. You're fire sign too, but you could be doing another fire sign. Aries or Sagittarius. Yeah, one of your wishes is coming true this month, definitely. Letter Y. There's the cup, by the way. So right in the beginning, look at this. You have a brand new beginning here, big opening here. I'm seeing you communicating a lot. The whole month, you're communicating a lot. You're going to be talking a lot. I don't know if you have like a lot of meetings you're going to, or you're just a public speaker. You're, you, you, maybe you have like um, a public presence that you do, like you're, you're on social media or something. You could be a YouTuber, a vlogger, a blogger stuff like that you're just talking a lot communicating a lot i'm seeing number 17 here so the 17th could be significant i'm seeing year of the rooster year of the rat year of the dog year of the goat and i'm seeing someone watering like a garden and i'm also seeing aries here as well so aries season could be significant with this cup like connected somehow but I'm seeing someone watering like their garden, like taking care of it, like it's very precious to them. So this could be like your your own business. Chinese year of the dragon here. And number eight is showing up again. So year of the goat, Leo energy, which is you. You're going to be very abundant. Wow, you have like a lot of great things coming towards you. That's building in February. They're not happening in February. Letter R, letter F, but they're building. Okay. And something with this new beginning is connected to Capricorn season. All right. So, um, yeah. It's really great. So it's happening right now. You're doing the, the things you need to do. I'm here and doing the deed. <laughs> okay. Uh, I'm seeing a ribbon here. Like, I'm seeing like, like a victory here. Something that's like a precious gift here. This can also be representing like, you know, um, breast cancer and stuff like that. 
Number 30 is here. 7 is here. 51. 38, I'm hearing. I'm seeing that you're protected. Spirit is protecting you. And I'm hearing, I'm trying to keep you happy. Someone's trying to keep you happy here. Spirit's trying to keep you happy, keep you afloat. Maybe you've just been going through a hard time here. I'm seeing you're the goat is here. And you're the dog is here. And Leo, you're you're all over here. Still in the beginning. You're you're chasing towards something. Like you're you're going past obstacles here. Like you're you don't want to be caged in. You don't want to be confined to things. Like you want to be set free. You want your independence, I'm hearing. You, you definitely want to move on here. I see you moving on from a relationship as well that's keeping you trapped, keeping you stuck. You want to be like the eagle. You want to head out. You want to fly. You want to go. I feel like you've been feeling trapped here. You also miss your friends, I'm getting. A lot of you miss your friends. Maybe you're just at a distance. Towards the middle of the month, I'm seeing you getting communication. Chinese ear of the dog here from a loyal friend, someone that really wants to talk to you. And I'm also seeing a candle here. So you're being shown the way. This person's being shown the way too. I'm seeing Chinese ear of the rabbit is here. Letter C. Chinese ear of the pig. And there's also a helping hand here. This could be meeting with a stranger that could be important for you. That could be um, changing your life in some kind of drastic way. Where you're going to be making a lot of money. A lot of you are welcoming a, a new love here. I mean, um, I didn't mean to say that. I meant to say like a new baby. Like a child. Like new baby into your life. But a lot of you could be <laughs> welcoming new love, right? Year of the Dragon is here. So yeah, definitely Chinese Year of the Dragon. I'm seeing you a lot of, a lot of you not being single anymore. You're going to be creating... A child here if you're not already pregnant if you're pregnant you're giving birth this month because i'm seeing you holding a baby here like in the air like so happy proud you're the rabbit you could have got pregnant right and you're the rabbit and now it's coming right now you're the snake is here as well and just a lot of um change here magical change especially with your love life it's being healed here. Now towards the end of the month, I'm seeing there's a change of plans here. There's a there's a new bridge being built for you to go down a different direction here. Towards cancer season, I'm seeing. So this could be happening more towards cancer season season. I'm I'm seeing a star here. So a wish is coming true towards the end of the month. Yeah, I'm hearing row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. So it's like, yeah, just take your time. <laughs> you know what I mean? Be steady. Go down the stream, you know, in a safe way. No rushing here. I'm seeing Pisces energy here as well. I'm seeing somebody that's like masked here. Like they're wearing like a mask. They almost look like a ninja here. So this could be someone that you're not aware of. You don't know who this is. Maybe they're hiding their feelings. They're hiding something from you. Who is this? Okay, so Chinese year of the dog. This could be someone in your family. This could be an older man, a friend, or a child. Oh, they're going to be talking to you. This person is actually going to speak up towards the end of the month. You're definitely going to find out who this is. This could be someone that has a lot of feelings for you. They are definitely connected to the Chinese year of the dragon here. And I'm hearing F you. So maybe you're going to tell this person to go F off. I'm hearing somebody wants your forgiveness as well. Chinese ear of the dog is here. Chinese ear of the snake. I'm hearing hotel too. Maybe you're getting a hotel. Going to be staying in a hotel for a little while. I don't know. Traveling. I'm seeing Chinese ear of the dog here. There's a dog and there's someone meditating here. This is like a loyal friend. Someone that stay, stays by your side. You're cleansing your energy. I'm seeing that your aura is like very clear. You know what I mean? 
that you're healing through something. Letter M, letter P. Yeah, Chinese ear of the dog is heavy here. Someone that really wants to be there for you no matter what. And your home is changing, like your home environment is changing here. Let's get some tea leaves. Your home environment is changing here. Love wanted to come out. Yeah, your love life is changing, definitely. Your relationship. So. Let's see. Someone will gossip about all your secrets. Hidden secrets can harm you. Holy shit, you have secrets twice. So not good. So you're going to definitely be finding this out. And it's going to like make you upset. You will be playing a different role. It's going to make you change your decision. You're, it's going to make you upset at first. But then you're going to make a decision to, to head out. Because you're going to be doing something different. Alright, that's all I have for you. Thank you so much. I wish you the best. And I send you many blessings. Namaste. Love and light.